Hi, I'm so glad you've decided to join us today. This channel is all about the journey, where life is taking us, and the things that we do to get there. I want you to come with me and experience all these things together. <laughs> Make sure you're doing your work. Yeah, it does. Do, well. Do your work. Hey, everybody. So, we just got back from getting the car inspected, and the kids are working on some math. And, um,. We are just moving right along with our homeschool day. We're having a really good day today so far. Um, and the kids seem to be liking homeschool. So let's see what the kids say about that. I do like, do, I like homeschool. But, bye bye, I don't want to see you. Elizabeth, how do you like homeschool? It's good. Really good. Good. Hey everybody, so I just wanted to pop on here and make a quick video um, today. So we have been busy this week. Um, it's just been a really crazy week. Uh, but it's been a good week for homeschooling. Um, we have, uh, you know, been moving right along. Um, we had have a... Um, car inspection today and uh, we're just taking the books and stuff that we have like our work books that I've bought that kind of thing with us for them to do a little bit of homeschool while we're out and about um, Curtis we started using a workbook <clears throat> a little bit for his math um, we're using the easy peasy all on online uh, the free curriculum um, and the math is great um, but it's not enough, I don't think, for him particularly. He loves math, and I just don't feel like it was giving him enough. So we have started substituting with um, just a book I got from Walmart. Um, nothing special. It's actually uh, first grade level. So it's just a little extra just to get his mind thinking around those, you know, things a little bit more. Um so he worked on that and Elizabeth worked on writing cursive. I bought her a little little book this dry erase and she can practice her cur cursive skills. Um, so she practiced writing uh, cursive while we were there. And it was only about 15 minutes but you know what every second counts whenever you're doing homeschool. It's just making sure that you are incorporating learning into everything and they absolutely loved it. They thought it was great. They got to get out of the house to do homeschool and they got to sit on a dirty couch and uh, the horn honked on the car um, as they pulled it in and the it like startled the kids and they thought that was funny and it was really great. But um, anyway, it's okay, you know, to take books with you and to do workbooks out and about. You don't have to just be stuck at, you know, your little table and your little homeschooling area. You know, get them out. Um, don't feel like you have to be confined in your house if you're homeschooling. You know, it's okay to take them to the park and sit at a, a bench, on a bench, um, or a picnic table at the park and do homeschool there. You know, you don't have to just sit in the same spot every day and be bored out of your mind. Um, which is something that, you know, it takes learning to, you know, adapt to not, oh, we're not, we can't go off our, our schedule and we can't go off our, our material that we're using. No, throw the material out sometimes, grab that workbook that doesn't have anything to do with, uh, what you've been learning that, you know, that day or, or that week and just, um, you know, make learning fun and adventurous and, you know, make it a journey um it's great to just get out of the house sometimes and of course me as a parent homeschooling this is all new to me a uh, first year right and i'm trying to learn how to 
not only homeschool, be a full-time mom, but also to get everything that I normally would have done, done. So, like, I have to get the car inspected, and I have to go pay the bills, and I have to go grocery shopping, and I have to get all of these things done within a week's time on top of homeschooling. So, it's just learning to do that and learning to balance things and learning that, you know, learning on the go is okay uh, is really... Um, it's, it's something that's a learning process. It's not something you're going to be like, aha, look, I get to just take the kids here and there. And, you know, they get to learn as we do things. Like I know I posted a while back, we went to the eye doctor and we had to sit in the waiting room for a while. And I read them science books, um, about, I think it was the muscle system or the, 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 uh, skeletal system, one or the other. Anyway, I just read them that book, uh, a couple books, while we were sitting there waiting. And they got the reading, they got a little bit of science, and it was great. And here's Curtis. Hi, buddy. What Mom, you doing? I need to ask you a question. What? What? Not a question, but I want to tell you something. What are you tell me? I've been working on nine of that Yes. for a while on strawberries. Yeah, that's good. Say hi. I just finished. Are you done? Hi. I think I see a blank one over there. A blank? Yeah. A blank. <laughs> Are you talking about this blank? What? What blank? On your book. Is that a blank spot? It's a blank spot. Anyway. Um. I think I need to help him right now. He's, he's, I think, got a blank spot on his book, and he's trying to say it's done. It's not. It's not? Okay, we'll I see. Need. But anyway, we'll see you guys again really soon. Say bye. Bye.